Hey guys, hello and welcome. In this video, I will show you how to use image sc command in MATLAB. So let's get started. For example, you have the follow following situation. For example, you have a set of discrete points x and y. So x is x changes from 1 to 3, 4 and y is also 1, 2, 3, 4. And then for each element of x and y, you have a val value and let's say call it z. So in this case, you will have a z which will be a 4 cross 4 matrix. So, so for each, each element of x and y, you have a corresponding element. So let's plot this in MATLAB. So let's plot this in MATLAB using ImageSC command. So what this essentially will do is that it will take each value as a color pixel. Let me show you how to plot this in MATLAB. Let us create a new script. So here you have x uh, which is a ASCII file with element 1, 2, 3, 4. You have y which is a ASCII file with uh, elements 1, 2, 3, 4. And z is also an ASCII file which is a 4 cross 4 matrix with the following elements. So let's plot this in MATLAB. So you can see it shows colors of different rectangles with 4 cross 4 rect rectangles with different colors depending on the value of z because as I showed you for each value of x and y you have different values of z so here z is a 4 cross 4 matrix so as you can see in the figure that there are 4 cross 4 matrix of different colors. Now let me show this with a real experimental data. So in this, I have a X data. Which is 1 cross 300. I have a Y data. And I have the Z data. So let's plot this in MATLAB.
You can also add a color bar. You can also add the X label and Y label. You can also change the color from here. Go to edit, color map, from here go to tools, then you have this standard set of color maps. Here you can, you can see that you have different standard color maps. For example, if I select Parula. You can see that the color combination has changed. You can change to any color desired color combination you have. I can change Z. So you can uh, choose any color from here uh, as per your requirement. You can also do this manually. Just double click on the color rectangle and change the color. Let me show you. So you can do this manually also. Okay that's all for this video. If you like this video, hit the like button and also subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.